Desert cash, is that what Dean calls it? Desert money or something. Desert money, whatever. tissue on the go. Tissue to go. Okay, real quick. There's a list for both cars, right? right? That's what we're basing our tool set on. We're gonna take the seat bases off. We're gonna put them down here where they belong without seats on them to give us a flat area to put all this stuff and all everything else that Brandy will pack, like, you know, probably about 47 different outfits. That's not true, I'm gonna not. Per day. I'm not doing that. What's going on in here? I'm, I'm updating our list because okay. we got stuff we can take off. So the antenna, we're still, we can put that on, but we're waiting for the ends. But to what it. we're really going to do is this, right? Right, we are. Oh man, look at that. This we have mess. to go through all. So you might be interested to stay with us and go through this. I know. If it's you're, like a, I mean, if you're ever going to go on a ride, mm -hmm. a long ride, and yeah. you want to know what you should take with you, watch what we pack. And then if something happens when you watch the ride and we don't have what we need, you'll know to take all this plus yeah. whatever we missed. Or if you know better, you know, point it out. Then please point it out if you like us because we're never done but 100 We're in the ballpark. And so what's left on the list? Okay, so antenna, we're like 99% we're waiting on the ends, yeah, right? Yeah, waiting on parts. Too. Okay. Um, what else do we have to do? We did the harnesses. Basically, you have one more harness. Final harness. It's Just, actually uh, mostly in. It's 90% in. So I'm gonna do, no, it's 99% in. Don't okay. be ridiculous. It's 99. You just got to wind it through. I can go ahead and bolt that spare tire in place as soon as we get the antenna in I'm place. I'm going to say spare, and then I'm going to say ends because we know what that means. Amanda? Amanda. <laughs> okay, and then um, what else we got? Uh, the the Can-Am is going, so... Yay, by the way. Yeah, there was a chance it wasn't going to go. You know what? I'm going to tell you something right now because I'm excited. DJ it got his dream job. Yeah. So we were worried that he wouldn't go. He's going, and he starts after we leave. So yeah. give him props. Yeah, absolutely. And we're, so we're going to detune this thing so That's we on can here. run regular fuel in it. And mount the axle that we bought for it. Yeah, yeah. We have an extra axle. Uh, and I haven't heard from Clausen. We need to get a hold of them tomorrow and see if we have an extra axle there. But yeah, we're pretty close. I had to call Polaris, actually, yesterday, day before, whatever day it was. And I talked to their customer service, and I wanted, I said I was going to give props, so I'm going to. So Michaela, awesome. That was my first responder. But then I talked to Danny, and Danny's in our life. Tend to be amazing. So Danny at Polaris. Thank you so much for taking care of us and for being amazing. We appreciate you. Thank you for watching and um, stay tuned. Absolutely. All right. So, speaking of Polaris, look at this bad boy. Um, so, anyway, basically, we're going to take the seat bases off. We're going to put them down here where they belong without seats on them to give us a flat area to put all this stuff and all everything else that Brandy will pack, like, you know, probably about 47 different outfits. That's not true. I'm going to not. Per day. I'm not doing that. Yeah, all right. Cut. All right, let's do this thing. What, what we're going to start with is this bag that's been laying on the floor driving me it's insane. It's our most it's like, annoying pile. It's like a, what, what would that, that's like a bag a, of snakes. bag of snakes. It's ugly. Yeah, and it's just exploded. I can't Ugh. take it anymore. So we're going to pull a couple of key things out of this right now. We're going to set the bag aside, then we'll come back to it. That's one key item. I know. So let's throw that over there by the belts. And, then, and you know, wifey is not about a thrower. She's about a, a winder. Yeah, so so for now, I'll fix it later. So we're winding. We a got few, that. There's a few key items we want to keep aside. All of our uh, soft shafts. We don't want oranges. We don't do oranges. Doesn't yeah. match my eyes. So, all right, we're going to go through this and we'll be back in a minute. Yeah. Right, look at all this. In a matter of seconds, this was actually configured. Milliseconds. Milliseconds. Um, you. Yeah, so we have... This is all, so this is all the stuff that uh, ultimately uh, we think we want to take. There's a few other items. Pan maybe. over it like slowly. So if you guys see anything that we're missing, tell us because I don't want to get stranded in the desert. I want to ride. Yeah. Triple so, S. So this is everything I think that we're taking with us. We might, we, we have a few items left. We have another axle. This is a Can-Am axle. That Can-Am axle is for Rob Mello. You know who Rob Mello is. They call him Rob Mello. Exactly. Yeah. This one is for our Can-Am. We have one coming for the Razor. I know it's a brand new car, but we're going to have two Razors on this trip. And you, yeah. So we're going to take an extra axle. We have extra ball joint. 
It's called Plan for the Worst. Plan for the Worst. Oh. Anyway, so we start over here at our empty bags, right? And one of those bags was the bags that we've been carrying with us in the Can-Am. Uh, I bought another big one. I don't know. We have too many bags. <laughs> we have a lot of bags. But, um, we, bags. Yeah. so all this stuff we're going to organize right now, and we're going to show you where we put it, how we put it. Right. And you can tell us what we did wrong. Well, I mean, let me just wrote, like, ball joint press. We have the... Like, this is going to be for your spring... Com I don't even know if yeah, we're going to need that. Yeah, that's not going. Probably not going to go. Spring compressors aren't going. We have, like, the Can-Am. That's the clutch tools in that bag. We have lighting, batteries, extra batteries. We have the tools for that. We have wrenches, a million and thousand yeah. zip ties. We're gonna, well, we're going to go through them right now. Oh, okay. But more importantly... Right oh, now, guys, let me show you this. And this is important because I didn't talk about this before, but look at this yeah, bag. We, First of all... A lot of things happened in between when we got this and now. And, uh, and it kind of got we kind of got lost. It was on the but trailer. But look at this. How cool is this? Uh, it is SupremeSuspension.com. Supreme, suspension .com. Supreme yes. suspension. So in Glamis, these people were super gracious. Thank you guys. We went in, and I won this in a fair and square game contest. I won. But let me tell you something. It was fate. We never get stuck. You guys know that. Yeah. I mean, very rarely. Uh, twice in maybe five years. Yeah, and so we were in Glamis, not thinking we were going to get stuck, because we don't get stuck in Glamis. We did. Yeah. Had we not had this that I won, this is what pulled us out. This and is their no recovery rope. We're not, we're not even kidding around. We actually got first stuck for the first time ever in Glamis. The neighbors came we, over and pulled us out with this. And we had uh, this with us. I and mean, this rope is badass. First of all, look at it. Black. Like the it's night. It's super nice. And just freaking, it has the, yeah. what's it called? Uh, kinetic. Uh, yeah, kinetic. It's a kinetic rope. Yeah. So this rope, I think, is 30 feet. Uh, yeah, and it's freaking awesome. And it pulled out our F 250 with our 42 foot long toy hauler, the wolf pack behind it. No problem. Easy peasy. So, so spring. That's the, what I call them. Supreme Suspension. Thank you guys for this. Um, big props. It worked wonders. And I feel like maybe you got it stuck on purpose. Yeah, right? It's fine. Let's do this. Yeah. Okay, so I think we came up with a plan. Here we go. Basically, we got our main bag. Yep, yeah, we got the main bag. And this is going to be like, you need to grab a bag because you've got to fix something. Like, what do you need? Yeah. Well, we need wrenches because yeah. we need wrenches. That's and why. And that's I a full set. So, uh, somebody made fun of me. Honestly, those, <laughs> it's a it's a 15 piece set. Wait, pull it back out for a minute real quick. So, oh. no joke, it's from Kmart. Uh, don't give me a hard Who time. Who cares? Yeah, I will fix a car with this all day. So show me your fancy $700, no, dollar, whatever. Yeah, right? But this is going on the road and with this. And then show me fixing so, a car. So let's do this. Go through it. It goes what? It goes six. Uh, okay, this is going to go um, actually, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 21, 22, 25. Yeah. Okay. And so that, it's hard to find a set that covers that and range. 18 is in here. Yeah, 18 is in there. And it, so it's hard to find a set, an inexpensive set that covers that. Uh, that's like 20 bucks from Walmart. Okay, so we're going to start with And that. we fixed a million things with these kind of wrenches, so yeah, we're build, shit. We're building a base. Remember, inexpensive tools for a bag that we're taking on a trip with us. And it could get stolen, and yeah. it's definitely going to get banged around. So this has metric and standard shallow. Then I picked Got up a deeps. set of metric deep. We really only need metric, but they didn't have we don't know, though. what I wanted. Somebody else's car that we're with on the trail might Too not be metric. bad for them. Yeah, right. We help everyone. Yeah, um, okay. So then we also then have, we have quarter this quarter drive. inch. Yeah, quarter inch drive and then this is quarter and three eighths inch and this is just a random compilation that, apparently that's no those are torques okay oh. it's missing check this out real quick it's missing a 20 quarter inch drive 20 torques 20 right i actually had it in my hand at lowe's and i put it back it was a craftsman anyway the 20 uh is very rarely used for anything we would have to work on so we're gonna we're leaving that in the video because i'm gonna, gonna happen, go right? get it i'm yes. gonna go get okay, it okay good I'm gonna so get you know it. what's gonna happen i'm getting it I'm getting it. Okay, right. so let's pack this in here nicely. So we have a base. Yeah. We've got to build our base. Rinse set, socket set. Rinse and socket base. Right. My favorite kind of base. Okay, real quick. There's a list for both cars, right? right? That's what we're basing our tool set on. Okay, the suspension on the Can-Am right there needs an 18. If if we have to work on have to work on the suspension, and guess what? 
both of those sets of sockets missing an 18. Conspiracy. So I went on Amazon and I bought that. That completes our sockets. I don't know if we'll throw that in there. Or, well, we're, we're going to have a bag of we're extra. Put in the bag. We, got, we have we're extensions away. We're not going to throw anything in there. All right, let's so, do it. We'll just list everything we're taking and you guys can then look. Please look at it and tell us if you think we're missing anything. If you've broken on the trail, tell us what you broke. All right, screwdrivers. We bu I bought a whole set of screwdrivers. They're Pittsburgh. Got They're, it. They seem pretty decent. They'll probably do the job. I wish they were going in our tool chest because they're so <laughs> well, I'll get another. So no, it doesn't matter. They're cheap. Screwdrivers. Okay, this goes over here, actually. Yeah. Okay, screwdrivers. Check. All screwdrivers. Bag of screwdrivers. Bag of screws. Um, now we're going to do squeezies. Uh, this is new. Yeah. Let's take it out of the package because it'll take a little space. We don't want it Let me, uh, we'll you know what? Let me use this to cut it open. All right. So we got the squeeze tools out of the package. Uh, these are kind of cool. I don't, you know, I mean... I, I was looking for some cars. I couldn't find them. Well, I think they're awesome. The cutter plaid. They're actually more like, I don't know. I forgot what you call them. Anyway, they're cool. We'll I like them. them. We won't ever use them. Maybe. And we'll then we have these. Some cutters. Bop, bop. All right. So okay, those so go. we got the squeezies. Yeah. And we're going to throw our, uh, there's a crescent right there. This is too big to fit in here. So it's going to be loose with the hammer. Okay. In All the right. bottom. Right. And it has to be. It's just a large crescent and a hammer. I don't know if we'll throw that in there. So we're not going to throw anything in there. We couldn't. I mean, we'll know where it is. Okay. Okay, so there's that, guys. All right. Okay, so, oh, it's getting heavy. Perfect. Right. We like a heavy bag. Okay. Let's go over what we have left. That's okay. the 18 millimeter sockets that are not in the set. And, I, and because Danny likes extensions so much, I went crazy on extensions. I know, I know. That one's not going to fit in the bag, the long, long one. Gonna it's going to have to go loose in the bottom. I don't know if we'll throw that in there. We're not going to throw anything in there. And we're going to stick all of our uh, extensions, sockets, uh, these... I consider uh, so this a uh, quarter inch drive, three inch drive, half inch drive for, for a quarter inch drive impact. Right. That's going. Uh, these, those, okay, hold those up, 27 and a 30. Those are axle net sockets. They're impact sockets. And we're taking that big boy right over here. Here, we take that big boy right there. Then we, if we have to change an axle, done. It's happened before. Alright. Uh -huh. so, so all this goes in here. Yeah. This and then well, real quick, we have an adapter right here. Mm -hmm. Half inch drive to three eighths. Yep. And let me show you something else that's kinda cool that we're gonna take on this trip real yeah, quick. Sure, See this D wall? <sighs> we're gonna charge here, hold that for me. Yep. So if you notice, it's actually a little tiny half inch drive impact. Watch, well, turn it sideways and pull that off. So look, it's a half inch drive impact, right? But I bought this thing. Let me see it. It's actually DeWalt brand. It adapts your half-inch drive impact into a quarter-inch drive. Yeah. So we're going to take that with us. That's for our quarter-inch drive stuff. Uh, and then we have in? this big one for the big stuff. You want this just in here, right? Uh, there's already one in there. We might... Well, go ahead. Okay. Do you want actually, it in there or put it on here? Put it on there, yeah. Okay, because that's what... Yeah. So we okay. might take this DeWalt case with the Milwaukee and the DeWalt in it. Oh, we'll see. Okay. We'll see how things fit. So basically, we have a bag of tools. This is this is the tools. How heavy is that? And will it close? Oh, it'll close. Will it close? <gasps> yeah. How heavy? It's heavy. I wouldn't I, want to carry it for miles. I can see the look on your face. But it feels like my purse. I <laughs> wouldn't doubt that. Right. It's kind of heavy, actually. Okay. Right. It's but it holds be. everything. It does. As far as the main tools. So, so that's the, the main tool. That's our main tool box. I feel like this stuff, is, uh, this is extra. So we're going to put one little tool bag together. This is for changing a clutch out. Well, it's the most likely thing to happen is uh, for us to have to change a clutch. Right. So I mean a clutch, a, a belt. A belt. We know what you meant. So. So this is, you know, obviously the thing. Yeah, that's our clutch I'm tool. I'm just going to get in here. All right. Um, and then we're going to put in... Uh, that's for pulling a primary. Uh, we also have a Polaris. I loaned it out. It'll be back soon. So can I put it in here with this so yep. we know where that's it is? For Can-Am. Flex. For, you can use the, the quarter inch drive impact on it to pop the, the cover off. Not on our car because we have pins. You can pull that tip the out. Pull the Dewalt tip out. Oh, but um, what about this one? Will this fit the Razor that we don't have pins in? Yep. Okay. Sure will. And other people's cars. Bam. Yeah. Okay, so this is that bag. That's now, it. that's going to go there. That's it? What about a light? I kind of like the idea of having, yeah, that's a clutch slash light. Okay. And well, because it's stuff that you need at nighttime. Hold on. I bought extra batteries for that right there. Oh. Smart. Okay. Perfect. Right? Yeah. 
I think we can start with all this stuff. Tire. Okay, okay let's go through the tire stuff since we're doing this. I okay, got well. a tire sealant and inflator I bought at Walmart. It's an emergency fix-a-flat. I have also purchased a deluxe tire repair service kit. I bought that one. That I did. That's the good one. Whatever. I you used my. You bought the slime. I did buy this tire valve you stem bought repair that one, kit. And you bought that slime one. I did buy this. So here's the I, thing, real quick. Let me point something out. If you have one of these in your car and you're new to this, uh, after a few months, take it out and put new glue in and it because the glue goes away. Yeah. We have one laying around here somewhere this and the glue's dry. You can buy the glue glue individually. All right, so this is our tire, flat tire bag. And we've actually used this. Absolutely. We just used that one recently. So, um, it's not very good, I'm going to tell you right now. Uh, this bag, I think. Uh, make it the smallest one, maybe. Okay. It let's, will, see we'll, we'll, let's see if it'll fit let's in Let's see if it'll fit. Start with the base. Start with the... I'm going to put this in the corner. And then I want to put these in the bottom. Yep. Underneath of it, actually. The base, I the see. Base, yeah. The base, the base. Okay, yeah. And then that guy goes over here. And then we want to go put this on top. Yeah, plenty of patches, that's for sure. That's for sure. And then we want to lay this guy out. Oh, we have, you have a, uh, what do we have here? Look right here by your knee. This is going to be the uh, tire valve stem repair kit because you never know. What do we got in here? We got valve stems and valve stem caps. Yeah. Awesome. That's I mean, pretty cool. Because we've had problems, Boom. I feel like, with everything. So that's the tire kit. We could have for sure. You know what we should do? Hold on. We're going to add to our little kit. Oh. Watch out for that. Uh, uh, just oh, some. a tire, a freaking air gauge? No way. I'm not giving up an air gauge. Yep. I have an extra one. It's in Hold the this. exploder. And. Oh, gosh, yeah. Now watch, I'm going to do this, and then we're going to need them in here for some reason, but. We're going to take these with us. You know, you could rip off a valve stem or what something on a rock. What about for the valve stem fish outer? Yeah. Uh, there's probably yeah. one in there, is oh. there? Oh, yeah, in the kit. Yeah, there's oh, no, there's not. Not this guy. Go ahead and stick it in there. It's fine. Okay. Because this, uh, this whole bag is coming back to the garage anyway. And then we got the tubeless tire valves, and we got, yeah, good, yeah. good call. Here's our flat tire repair kit. So that that's that, right? right yeah. Okay, so that's the repair kit. But so, so far we have our main, main tools. We have our flat tire uh, repair kit, and we have our clutch, uh, belt change bag. In-car bag, yeah. And behind, Brandy over here, look at that stack of, stack of belts. We'll go over that in a minute. Yeah. That might go, I'm thinking about it. Yeah, that is to change a ball joint. That is to. where it's going. It's I up. bought that on Amazon, it's going. And there's the ball joint right there. We need a freezer. We're good. <laughs> All right. So I feel like the rest of the stuff, the tape, the zip ties, this stuff, and we probably could leave some of those zip ties out of the mix. <laughs> uh, like what do you mean? Let's see. I feel like I need all of them. Let's lay them all out and see which ones are duplicated. Does but it? some of them should go back to the trailer as well. They're skinny and these are a little fatter. All right, well, we'll take them all and figure it out later. Yeah, I'd say let's take all of them. Right. I mean, they're none of them. We're are the taking a lot of zip ties. ties on this trip. What if someone's driving a white lightning colored Polaris? Hi, right. call us. All right. Zip ties. Uh, grow a tape can go in that pile. Yeah. And I know it's it seems weird, but I, I feel like all this stuff could go with that. I feel like it's right because that's an emergency one more bag. kit. Like emergency, something broke, we need to zip tie it. Emergency, we need a CV boot. Make it out of Gorilla Tape. Emergency, Brandy's hand got cut. That's probably what's going to happen. Get the first aid kit. There you go. Start with the base. I'm going to do a base. I'm going to build a flat base. Make it stout. Anything that's flat can go on the bottom. Kind of hold it. Mm. Hold up to the twenty eight. We got that heavier item. I got a million zip ties, so <laughs> I'm okay with it. I'm not. I think we're over the top on zip ties, but that's okay. Mm -hmm. But I'm gonna do this. Okay. okay. And then I have some gloves because I need them, and everybody needs gloves. I bought my husband some new ones. I'm gonna take more pairs than this. This is just the beginning. <laughs> That brandy will pack like you know probably about 47 different outfits. That's not true. I'm gonna not. Per day. I'm not doing that. So good thing it's his bank bag. Um, got that. We got some. These are gonna go in the car. We got this and a whole roll and some paper towels for emergency yeah. use. Yep, yep. Um, this is gonna go in the car. And so this is our emergency bag as it stands right now. So that pretty much covers it, right? I think. Right. Um, I mean. Let's tape that up and throw it in there. Um. And then what we're going to do right now is we'll do a quick little exercise. We're going to grab the big impact, make sure everything fits in here. Then I think what we'll do super quick uh, is we're going to 
put the base bases down in the back of the car and start kind of just stack this stuff in and see how it fits. I agree. That's see where idea. we're at. Yeah. All right. Let's oh, do this. Um, right. So I forgot a couple things for the emergency bag, so I'm going to throw them in because we have room. Okay. All right. Very what do we got there? Item. We got desert cash. Is that what Dean calls it? Desert money or something. Desert money. Whatever. Tissue on the go. Tissue I got to go. Roll for us and the kiddos. We each have our own. You run out, you're on your own. Use yeah. your hand. Okay, so you so got to go in there. You got to go poop. You could probably uh, fit a whole roll in there, but whatever. Well, this is a whole roll. It's 84 sheets. How much okay. more do you need? I don't know. Well, you know. I'm not going to do it. Is there some spritzers in there? But uh, yeah, listen to me. Let me finish. There's antibacterial wipes. Oh, wow. Yeah, you're There right is a waterless soap. Our so, bag just got full. It's fine. I'm not even trying to zip it yet, but it will zip. I have to take this right. stuff out. We'll come back. Wait, anyway. The next thing is, this is what our clothes, mostly Brandy's probably that, might right. hold her clothes. Right. So that's, what, that's what's going to hold... Uh, the clo our clothes, shoes, stuff like that. All right. And that's going to go on one side. We'll throw it on the other side for now. And that's pretty much, I mean, that's pretty much there. A ratchet strap over the top of that and it's done. Or maybe yeah. not even a ratchet strap. And it's done. You're right. Yeah. Look at that. I mean. You, I bought this bag, guys, for $13.99. Adidas. She Sorry. is a bargain chopper. I am a bargain chopper. Okay, so, so. That's that. Now we have this whole side for uh, activity. tools. That's the tool side. So we're going to play Jenga right now and kind of see where we're at on this whole thing. Yeah. I need to build a base. Oh, build a base. So, you're right. I'm a Jenga expert, guys. Don't worry about it. So we're going to build a base with the DeWalt. It's holding the middle lock, but I hope it doesn't catch on fire. It <laughs> We're going to do that. Is we're going to do this, the heavy stuff. I got it. Because this is going to go under it to support it. Or maybe in the, yeah, in the floorboard. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Did I say or not say that I'm a Jenga expert? You don't tell me how to build a base of Jenga. There's that, that, that. There's that, the main, heavy, but accessible. We want to be able to get to this, it's the yes, main. We don't yes. want to bury these stuff. So it's going to go in the center, right here. Okay. All right. All right. And then what we're going to do is we're going to build around... We might find some kind of blanket or rubber to lay down over all this so we don't scar up the plastic. Uh, actually, I have a, um, I have a gray tarp. Okay. Oh, and um, this is our tire I kit. We, I don't know if we need the big one, but I, we'll, we'll throw everything in and go We're going to take it anyways, but... I'm going to do one of these. Okay. I can tell you right now we have plenty of space. Now there's a couple of items left. We have a, an axle coming for this car and I'm hoping that's in a box like this one is. Because mm -hmm. what I'm hoping is that we can kind of just lay these boxes back there somewhere and keep them that in the box. That would be sweet. Uh, possibly even tie down one of them on top of this spare tire. I don't know. But honestly look at this Jenga. Winner. Alright let's take a look. Wow. Now yeah. we're going to lay the Yamaha bag on top of this and we're going to put yeah. a tarp over all of it in case it rains. And we're going to use a tarp to cover it with ratchet straps to cover the whole thing. Two ratchet straps, one tarp. Nice. Right? I think we're probably pretty much... Uh, I'm going to hook them right here. I think we're pretty much... Uh, Done. Ish. I Finish. think... Uh, Gas cans, where are those going? I think... Uh, well, oh, God, this is the end. We're done with it. Go. 